Okay, welcome to a new edition of uh, Open Source Pump. Uh, this pump is uh, one of the pumps that we are selling as a whole, or you buy it piece by piece if you want, and you put it together yourself, but you'd be responsible if you don't follow our instruction. This pump comes with two components that are FDA approved, which is one is the cartridge here, used by other FDA approved pump uh, currently in the market so as the infusion set and both of these components are actually FDA approved and they are in the marketplace where you can get them off the shelf we decided to use these two items because they're most popular by large a lot of people prefer to use them so we decided to go with that no, as far as how you load the pump is pretty simple you just basically put the cartridge in there rotate a few times until it's recessed all the way to the corner of the nozzle when you see it like that it means your pump is being loaded then um, you put the nozzle back on and you secure it in the place okay and the menu looks pretty simple if you look at it uh, you got two icons here one is on the right side which is um, the syringe and the left is the battery condition and now you have also a control of backlights so you can save your battery uh, you got set any temp basil you have bolus now you can do that all day you don't have to use this uh, automated bolus basal review you can see what do you have currently set up cancel temp basal uh, you have bolus bolus means you could do autumn use automated bolus uh, for lunch dinner breakfast all that you know what time you want the pump would automatically would take care of it for you you don't have to use it if you don't want it but you know, automatic bolus is there so um also we have other options here where basil we cancel temp basil bolus uh, bolus correction you could do bolus correction here uh, you could go in here and actually make isf you know correction cbs tbs all that stuff how you want that taken care of um, remember any pop manufacturer will tell you four to six times a day you have to you know poke yourself and get a you know a test your you know uh, glucose level what that might be and then you know adjust your pumps and everything else accordingly that's a mandatory practice for uh, everyone by you know other manufacturer are telling you that you're supposed to do that so here's the prime you got bolus on demand the bolus review and then you know you have a drug indicator which basically tell you how much insulin you have on board and um, this pump uses 200 three days 67 units a day and takes a 67 units a day divides it by half puts half of it on a bolus and half of it on basil and basil portion is done on the top of the hour 724 so that's a basically an introduction to the pump hope you enjoy watching it uh, by the way this pump only uses one AA battery and you need to replace that every six seven days depending on how you use your backlights very simple nothing you know complicated um, you could tell the size of the pump it compared to a AA battery, for example, how big that is. So now you can compare it to something you know. It's four inch by five inch, basically, from outside to outside, four or five. Uh, it's a pretty nice pump. Works very accurate, just as any other pump. And we're giving this for open source. Put together or buy it as a whole and then you know assemble some pieces together yourself at $650 so everyone can afford to have a pump and hopefully that will help 
a lot of people who don't have insurance, they're type one and they're in and out of the ER, they're breaking you know the budget and just can't afford to have a pump because these pumps are very expensive, fifty five hundred dollar a piece. It's, it's a long way to go, my friend. And we made it a shortcut here for you. Hopefully it helps. Thank you for watching.